Hi, I'm someone to be named, and <laughs> you're a trailer for real. Do you know, Joe Dante said to me, really, you want to do anti-mame? Shouldn't you be gay? And he's right, actually, because this is a very gay movie. It's also a great movie. Um, Patrick Dennis wrote a book about anti-mame, and then I think Jer who are, Jerome Lawrence, yes, and Robert E. Lee, who wrote Inherit the Wind, wrote a play based on the book anti-mame. Both were gigantic hits. And this is a movie with a screenplay by Comden and Green based on the theatrical play, based on the book of Auntie Mame. So for this trailer, I will be gay and tell you my favorite gay joke, which is, do you know why gay men so often go like this? It's because sometimes there's just not enough room to go like this! Anyway, my name is Rosalind Russell, and this is Trailers from Hell. This is another one of those trailers that really do not do justice for the movie. This is kind of a pedestrian trailer for a wonderfully witty, truly funny and stylish picture. Here's Rosalind Russell as Auntie Maine. That's Andy Serkis saying hello to her there. And if you haven't guessed who by now... I'm your Auntie Maine! Rosalind Russell plays Auntie Maine. This was a huge hit on Broadway, and before that, a best-selling novel written by Patrick Dennis about his fictional Auntie Mame. There's Forrest Tucker as one of her husbands. On the left, you briefly see Coral Brown, who's brilliant in this, as the Broadway star. Uh, these are the upsons of ups and downs. Peggy Cass as Miss Gooch, who becomes pregnant because she took Auntie Mame's advice and she lived. This is a trailer that's really dull for a very funny, exciting movie with great production design. This production is extremely stylized. The production design is credited to some guy named Malcolm Burt, who I don't know who that is, with an interior design consultant, Robert Handley. Don't know him either. But they did a extraordinary job. You see her apartment change decor many times, and each one is more outrageous and really chic and funny. It's hard to be chic and funny when you're doing a set, but they really manage it. The costumes, the wonderful costumes, are by Ori Kelly. It's a, a very good movie and really funny. The tragedy of this trailer is it makes it look kind of dull. It's not dull at all, and it's very funny. It's not maudlin. <laughs> it's really sweet and sentimental in a good way. And I don't know, you see this staircase many, many times, and each time it's different. Peggy Cass, this was her breakout role, led to a career of mostly game show appearances, I think. Oh, the plot is young Patrick's parents are killed and he's left to his Auntie Mame. She becomes his guardian. Mr. Babcock, played by the wonderful Fred Clark, is the banking interest because this kid has left millions and millions of dollars. And Auntie Mame is very avant-garde. She's extremely um, progressive, very glamorous, very, very sophisticated. Come on, honey. We better go see Auntie Mame. Okay. You'd better, too. You wouldn't want to miss it for anything. You know what? This is a really good movie about conservatives, Gentiles, <laughs> and sophistication, and lack of sophistication. It's, it's a worldly, funny picture, and it's a tragedy. It has such a lame trailer.